What's up, YouTube world? I wanted to talk to you guys today about my trip to the dump. I went out to the dump. Uh, I know I didn't take video. It, it just didn't seem right. Um, but when you're here in Jacksonville, Florida, and you have a big trailer load full of whatever, um, yard waste, really, um, so, I, you know, I'm traveling uh, I-10 West, Headed out of, uh, what is it, the south side with a trailer full of stuff. Limbs, uh, dust, uh, dirt, wood chips from grinding a stump up that was about 15 feet in diameter with the roots. Um, you don't know what to do. So... I've never been out there. I've never had a job this large, and uh, I, I found it. Uh, they paid me really good. Uh, rented a stump grinder. Uh, took me, I think, a part of a morning and another part of another morning just to make sure everything was properly cleaned up, um, that the customer was happy. So, back to my trip on my way to I-10, going west towards, uh, I think it's Baldwin, uh, Florida. Get at the exit of 301 going south. It's probably a number of miles. And uh, so I didn't know exactly what to do. You know, I'm taking this long road into the, what Jacksonville says is their uh, yard waste slash uh, landfill slash waste management that uh, manages it for the city of Jacksonville on the commercial side. So, you know, I, I get through the, the toll thing where they weigh you in. They give you a number. So I, I have number, I think it was 44 or whatever it was. And uh, I drive in. And, uh, you know, I'm like, you know, give me some direction. Never been here before. So I just follow the truck that's in front of me. Okay, it's uh, another landscaper out there just doing yard work, you know, dumping his stuff. You know, I'm following him, following him. And all of a sudden, you know, I'm in this big line with other commercial trucks. And the guy that's following, there's another landscaper. He's probably like four or five uh, trucks ahead of me. And I'm in the line, just chilling, you know, taking uh, about 20 minutes to get through. I'm like calling numbers. I'm like calling the city, calling uh, different places, departments. They're transferring me over here and there, and I lose signal, so I have to call the city back. They uh, transfer me again to different departments, and they finally get me to the people at the front office of the landfill, and they uh, they they'd say. Um, yeah, you're supposed to just wait in line just like everybody else. Dump it on the west side of the hill there and, you know, just wait your turn. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so I wait my turn. The uh, guy that's directing traffic, so, he, you know, he probably got uh, 20 trucks in, in the area dumping, you know, people the um, waste management, uh, advanced waste, uh, different companies that have their big dump trucks or, um, trash trucks just dumping stuff out, dumping stuff out, dumping stuff out. So you got 20 of them. And then you got the yard truck that I saw earlier ahead of me. He was dumping his stuff out. And uh, so the one guy tells me, hey, park your, your truck over here. You know, my trailer gets stuck in the rut. The, the, um, the jack on my trailer gets stuck in the rut. So I'm like trying to drive and I got the uh, jack that you know when you want to unload you know park your trailer and jack the the trailer up and unhitch it from your truck that's dragging in the the, the dirt where it's like you know it's like all wet and it, we just had this hurricane so you got like my my truck was straddling the the, the ruts of the, of the road that these big trucks have made, so I got my um I I got it stuck. I got my truck stuck. I got my 
my trailer that's just like I'm like pulling a sled pulling a sled with my jack jack stand that jacks up my trailer into the dirt like I don't know if it's like a foot and a half or whatever so my truck wouldn't pull it so they had to get out one of the big uh, I think it's a D 8T cat uh, one of the bulldozers and he pulled me out of there <laughs> and uh, my front bumper is like bent up okay it's like a metal bumper and the guy's like well I'm, I'm afraid we're gonna rip that bumper right off I'm like no buddy you, you, you're not gonna do anything to this bumper it's you know it's like um, a chrome bumper but it has a, a nice uh, steel um, reinforced bumper behind that so all he did was he bent out my bumper more he, he just pulled that wrinkle out a little bit and you know things look good so you know I, i'm trying to back my trailer up in my truck and all um holding traffic up and uh so y you know uh all of a sudden all of a sudden i get stuck again Oh my goodness, the guy's like, well, you're not supposed to, you know, he's directing to her, you're not supposed to do this, hold it there, hold it there, and he's telling other people to hold it, and I, you know, I'm just backing stuff up again, this is the second time, so the guy pulls me out, he's like, um, this is a different guy, with a, another, I think they had three of these, uh, D8T uh, bulldozers, and uh, they were just helping me out, pulling me here and there. And um, then I got – the one guy, he thought he pulled me out just enough. So it was uh, for a third time, third time, the, the guy in the bulldozer, once again, it's a D8T uh, bulldozer, he pulled me forward out of the, the rut, out of the – I'm like, man, uh, dude, if you pull me out of here, it, I'm not going to come back here again. He's like, dude, why did you come here? You're supposed to go up front by the toll booth thing where they weigh you in and out. And there's like trailers, dump trailers, or um, what do you call those? Yeah, a, a trailer things where you throw your yard waste in there. I'm like, you got to be kidding me. I thought there was some place, but there's no direction. Nobody sent me anything anywhere. So long story short of this video that I'm going to do is to give the next Jacksonville person that goes, that goes to the yard waste place, you will get some information on what to do. You take the yard waste, if it's bags or whatever, from the house. I'm not talking about big branches and all that, but yard waste, like clippings and all that. And uh, the you take them to uh, the dump. Okay, the dump is off 301 south of Baldwin in Jacksonville city limits. Jacksonville owns the dump. Waste management manages the dump. Um, but you want to drive down 301 south of I-10. Then you want to take a right once you see the sign for the dump. Then you get up to pay for the what you're dumping so it's about 30 bucks I want to say it might be more but I think the first two tons it's 30 bucks so that's good to know so they weigh in they give you a number um, and uh, the yard waste containers are to the left to the left pretty much within the first I want to say first hundred yards. So you get through the toll, you go about a hundred yards, and you see the containers that you can put the yard waste in, and that's where you put your yard waste. And then you turn back around, and you go back 
through, but you scale out. And that's when they charge you the $30 for dumping. And um, I think it's a lot cheaper going there. It's a little further out, but it's cheaper to go there. You don't have to take your truck and all that all the way back to the big hill where all the commercial trucks go. Because they, they, they got kind of a dump truck feature in the trash truck and it just lifts up and stuff slides out and the people the employees of the uh, truck company the waste truck company the uh, trash truck guys um, they just uh, get in there and they clean up that stuff and uh, they drive away and uh, someone like me I won't go back in there and uh, get in their way really again <laughs> That's why I told the, the guy in the bulldozer, I'm like, dude, I'm not coming back here again. He's like, it's okay, man. It's okay. Like, it's my first time out here. And uh, so it was a great uh, time. Lesson learned. Uh, it just cost me about $30 to dump all this. About 30 bags of the Home Depot bags that I threw out. Um, people are super nice. Um and if you have questions, call the city before you go out there. It's a 904-63-CITY is the number. I'm going to put some information in the links down below. I'm going to also put the links to the city information. And uh, be safe when you're out there. Uh, just take your time. You got some speed bumps. You got people that want to help you. Everybody was super nice to me out there. Uh, when I called the city, uh, they were super nice. They helped me. They transferred me to all kinds of different places. Once again, thank the people that work for the city of Jacksonville, the county as well, because the city and the county, I think, are pretty much the same thing. Duval County is the city of Jacksonville. The city of Jacksonville is Duval County. That's how I feel about it because the city is so large. Um, so once again, let's thank everybody that helped me today. I don't know everybody's names, but I'd like to thank all the employees of uh, the city of Jacksonville. I want to thank the employee that wanted me to call him George Bush, even though he wasn't George Bush, but he's just joking around. Um, what else? Uh, so if you like, and you like the topic, subscribe. Give it the big thumbs up, so like it. And spread the word and let other people know about my videos, my topics. I want to talk about other things, not just what every uh, lawn care company talks about. I want to help other lawn companies out. I want people to know doing the right thing means following the rules. Um, learning what the rules are. You call the city, you call the whoever is the local government agent and say, hey, you know, what do I do? Uh, where do I go? Do you need? Do I need to get an attorney to get me in the right direction? A CPA, tax advisor. Uh, who, who do I talk to? You, you know, do the right thing. And as always, thanks and subscribe and give it the big thumbs up. Thank you.